Yo, what's cracking like in my beautiful sleep deprived and probably caffeinated best friends? It's God Complex back in the house. And today I'm going to show you guys how to get some extra frame rates on any game, including Rogue Company, specifically uh, the second half of the video. step of the video we're going to go over um, how to increase your frame rate on any application and this ties into anything you're doing with video games adobe um, uh, even chrome so we're going to go into this pc and uh, you should be able to see your hard drives listed so we're going to go to the hard drive that the game is installed on um, you should be selecting the hard drive when you do install these applications so you should be able to see which one you have the application located on so we're going to go into storage drive d i'm going to go ahead and show you on my diablo 3 x.x file you select the file then you right click and then you go to properties okay and then after you go to properties you want to head on over to the compatibility tab so on the compatibility tab you can check two boxes these two boxes will increase your frame rate by at least 30 percent um, so you want to disable full screen optimizations and you want to run the program as administrator. This will give it a little bit more of a priority in the processing tree so that it's sort of, uh, you know, guaranteed to run a bit better than anything else you're running at the time. So we're going to go ahead and hit apply. Make sure you hit apply. That's the most important step of the first half here. Um, so we're going to hit that and hit OK. So after you've done that to your application, I've already done it to my road company application. So you know, I don't have to do that again, but I just wanted to show you on an application I haven't done it on yet, which was the Diablo 3. So let's move forward and go ahead and get right into the Rogue Company settings. All right, guys, we got Rogue Company up. I'm going to go ahead and jump into the settings here so we can go ahead and go over all the options we have and the changes we need to make to try and optimize your frame rate in the game. All right, we already know Rogue Company isn't the most optimized game, even on the lowest settings. Uh, you may still have issues. That being said, I'm going to go ahead and quickly go through all the settings that you guys need to worry about to get those extra frame rates. First things first, you want to have it on full screen mode. And that will ensure that the game is sort of prioritized with uh, what's running currently on your machine. And this is with Windows machines specifically, but I know full screen mode sort of increases the frame rate because it sort of isolates the application a bit more. I have mine set to windowed full screen mode because I have to tab out and sort of browse other applications when I'm streaming. Go ahead and set that to full screen. And for resolution, you wanna try and set it to 1280 by 720 if you have a very low end uh, machine. Um, if, it's a, it's, if it's not, as as bad as um, gradually bring the resolution up see how it affects your frame rate first i i would recommend starting off with 1280 by 720 and then uh, i would move up from there to uh, 1920 by 1080 i don't have to have a resolution to optimize my performance so uh, moving forward you want to set motion blur to off ads blur off save frame rate 100 percent and global quality all the way down to low, colorblind correction, none. Unless you're colorblind. Yeah, I still think it looks pretty good and it's it's not that bad. So, all right guys, that's gonna do it for today's video. I hope I made your day just a little bit better. If you enjoyed the video, like and subscribe. Check out the useful links in the description and I will see you on the next video.